If you would like to see how I go from this to this, then just keep on watching because, yeah, I feel better. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's Shar from Shar's Fashion Nation. Now, if you know, on Tuesday I had my medical Botox. Does that look great? <laughs> now, it's for my migraines, but it has multiple purposes for this area. <laughs> I will say that. Now, I cannot color my hair. Kind of obvious. While waiting for it to heal. Now... Today I will prepare my hair with this lovely brush that I got off of Amazon. Um, that's just dead hair. But I'll tell you what, that's a better brush than the brush I was using. So, this is the hair color I use because this is the hair color that stays the longest in my hair. Sometimes it stays two months in my hair. I love that. If you want a great hair product, I do suggest Garnier Nutris. Um, it is a great product. It is a great company. They have hair color for everybody's natural hair tone. And it doesn't matter your nationality. Like She's light skin too. So <laughs> I'm sitting over here by the bright light. But... Yeah, so I always use this one because this one works best. I used to use the one with the white girl on the package, and that just never stayed because, you know. I think they may actually formulate this a certain way for every nationality, so remember that. So, I ran out of my Jergens soap, the coconut one. It was nice, but it wasn't the best. It was kind of too, it was really watery. Let's just put it that way. So when I went to go get this at the Rite Aid, I picked up a bottle of sweet peach and nectar native. Now I will say they do have great scents. You can go on their website and find yourself something that you like. I love a sweet scent. Something, ooh, that's so pretty. I can't wait to use this. So, like I said, you know, this is for doing my hair. And I found these really cute little scrunchies at the Rite Aid as well for under $4 for, I think, like six of them. Anyway, now let me show you something between the hair brushes. Okay, so between the hair brushes, between this one and this one. Now, I meant to do this video anyway. So, obviously, I just took my hair down, my natural, just natural natural waves and curls and going on in my hair all the time. So now that we have this like this, it may not be a perfect split on it, but we will take this one over here. Ooh. Ugh. Struggle is real with this thing. Okay, that's like I have hesitated sometimes for almost a week for brushing my hair out with this, okay? Not brushed, brush with this thing. So we have been used to these brushes. Look how much hair. Are. How much hair that just ripped out and of course I'll remove the hair from the other one um so look look at that that's a lot of hair that that took out I just put that one over by my glasses now we will clean this one out 
This is from brushing my hair out last night. That's not much. That's Even though you hear that, it's not pulling my hair. But look, that just glides through. And it doesn't, like I said, it doesn't pull like the other one, right? Now, this is great because you don't have to worry about this. And it has detangled my hair every morning. But I was like, I need to do my hair. So, I will show you how much dead hair. Now, there's a difference between, like, just brushing your hair and, and look at the difference. Look at that with this compared to this with this. <laughs> so anyway, now I want to show you how much dead hair. Now we have dead hair every day. Some people like, if you take really good care of your hair, it doesn't die. Actually, the follicles, right? This is Rob with the trash can. Um, your follicles, you actually get dead hair. And also, I don't wash my hair every day. I wash it once a week. And it stays clean. So, this amount right here is from this brush. This amount right here is from this brush. Now, let me show you the huge difference <laughs> in how much hair the old brush, the new brush. That right there, my friend, that is a big difference because most of this was pulled out. There's dead hair in there and there's hair that it just ripped on out. This, which is, again, it's this. Even though it took out the dead hair. I mean, that's, you know, cleaning it and this is after. So if, even if I put these two together, put them like this, put them together, right? Cleaning it today. Look, this is more. And this is the one that hurt the head. So now we won't put these together and throw them away. Um, I don't keep my dead hair. But remember, um, taking care of your hair is super important. Thyroid. Thyroid health affects the body as well, and, excuse me, affects your hair, your eyes, your organs. Um, it can cause you to have kidney issues, which I just found out that I have, um, but they wanted me to go see a kidney specialist. We will talk about this in endocrinology when I go this month. Am I going to let this get me down? Like, Y'all, back in 2008, I was told that I was going to die from a brain mass. And I to was told I had maybe three to five years to live. And, yo, I'm obviously still here, um, which is great. So, oh, I would put the hair color on while I'm sitting here, but I have some fabric sitting out. Um, I will actually be sewing this one this year. Let's see, uh, 1950s vintage. This is a remake of this pattern. You know what? I think a lot of people have misinformation about uh, remakes of vintage patterning. Like, people complain about the vintage pattern instructions, and then they complain about the make the damn garment in a positive way and stop freaking complaining. Now, the only thing that I don't like in the pattern that I will be doing is I'll need 
like one piece of the pattern, which goes for like right here, you know, for, but it's actually not necessary. <laughs> this is not necessary. So anyway, I'm going to color my hair and uh, tell me, what do you think the difference between these two brushes? And I love how like, look, even though I've missed a spot, I did, I missed that spot. I can just go back and you saw how thick and tangly that was. It was from back here. Look, that even, the other brush did not detangle all of the back. So, um, yeah, I'll be back. It'll seem like a minute for you, but it'll be longer than that for me. So, we'll be back. So, you know, this is how silly I look while the hair color is in my hair. We've got like 27 minutes to go on this. So, okay, this turned out really, really nice. It took like 20 years off me. No, just kidding. So the first thing I do when I get in the shower is because, you know, you see I color my brows. I take a Q-tip. I used to just take my pinky and go like that. And I'm like, you know what? Let me use a Q-tip. As you can see, it didn't take to all of the eyebrows. Sometimes it does. Sometimes it doesn't. But that's why we have makeup. It's the other magic. <laughs> if men know we can shape shift, they will tell the church. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, without brushing it out, it will look like this. Now, I'm going to brush it and then I'm going to put the Garnier Nutrice. Um, spray in it for revitalizing my curls in my hair because I got curls in my hair. My worst curls, I will tell you, are the ones on the back of my neck. Like those get like kinky nappy curl. I know out here on the east coast you just say curls. That's why. Um, but I get those really tight ones back here. And there's a lot of different cultures with, you know, hair like that. Like my friend Mountain Witch Christine. Yo, she got a head of curls. Yeah, she got a head of curls. Um, everybody in different cultures, like their hair, like our hair is almost the same in every culture but i like how this turned out so what do we always do when we do our hair <laughs> that's a little auntie Charton. um we usually do our makeup but i'm gonna try to be live tonight with makeup addict 1992 so you've got that right today <laughs> And I don't know what we're doing tonight. It's Freaky Friday. Because it's Freaky Friday. Freaky Friday. Freaky Friday. Freaky Friday. Freaky Friday. <laughs> Sorry for my shitty singing. Um, but anyway, yeah, so... Remember, take care of your health inside and out. And if you feel like you need to refresh yourself, you know, like I've been using, like, look at that. Look at the difference that made. Like, you had seen, like, that big gap of what looked like it wasn't there. You know what I mean? Here, I'll show you, like, there, see? Big difference. Even though it looks like I'm balding right there, which I'm not. Um, that hair was ripped out when I was a kid. Never grew it back. But still doesn't keep me from being me. So anyway. 
Freaky Friday tonight. Um, sewing videos later this weekend. And uh, stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed. Hopefully, I will see you for Freaky Friday tonight. Where we'll fill this in. <laughs> And I will see you later, hopefully. Please go check her out because Alexandria is really sweet and we don't have a lot of people showing up at 9, 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we would enjoy a bunch of positive viewers. So I hope you show up. See you later. See you in the next one, hopefully tonight. Adios.